everyone and welcome to my new doll repaint video. You know guys, I just came back home from my amazing 14 days cruise to Iceland and Scotland. Of course, I knew it would be cool, but this cruise was even better than I expected. Really, the best holidays ever. I felt so tired when I left on the cruise, really. I felt 100 years old, I had zero energy for anything. But right now I feel like I'm 33 and I'm jumping and running around and I have lots of energy for new dolls and for some other projects really very 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 happy about it already looking for a new cruise please stop me someone so i'm back i'm ready to work on new dolls and today guys it's gonna be kind of a quick face up but a very special because today we're going to repaint two barbie dolls for my mom my mom, if you know, she makes a lot of dresses for my dolls. So a couple of months ago she retired from her full-time job and now she's kind of full-time busy with doll dresses. Uh, here is her Instagram, by the way. She doesn't take any custom orders because she lives in Belarus and Belarus right now is behind an iron curtain. She cannot really take any orders from abroad. She cannot really get payments. Uh, shipment has also became more difficult. Difficult. But anyway, please support her on her Instagram. She uploads there lots of new doll dresses every week, I would say. So, and since she's also a full-time doll maker and Instagrammer, I think she needs a couple of pretty dolls. That's why I've bought for her these two beautiful ginger Barbie signature looks dolls. My mom has ginger hair, so I thought uh, two ginger dolls uh, would fit here the situation. They're absolutely beautiful. They have very different face molds, very different faces. I actually feel a little bit worried about repainting these two dolls because they already look very beautiful without my help. But anyway, let's see what I can do about it. Let's experiment with these two girls. Let's repaint them. And before we begin, guys, of course, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the bell button to get notified about new doll repaint videos, and of course, support my art here on YouTube with your likes. And also, please subscribe to my Instagram because I really have a lot of inspiration for my Instagram lately. I really upload daily stories there, showing my daily life and some shorts, reels, things like this. So subscribe everywhere and now let's start the transformation. So here are these two dolls from clothes. You can see that one looks kind of more snatched and another vice versa has kind of more white face with a little bit of puffy eyelids. Both of them are very beautiful. They both actually look like supermodels, really super beautiful girls. I actually probably like the one with darker loose hair more. The one in the silver suit looks more like kind of another insta chick, a Kardashian sister. And another one really gives me supermodel vibes or maybe like young Nicole Kidman vibes. Very beautiful, cold, kind of beauty. Which one do you like more, by the way? <laughs> Write me in the comments, the silver suit one or the one in the color block outfit. Please write it down in the comments. For me, it will be very interesting to know your opinion. So now let's enjoy their faces one more time because I'm going to remove them with acetone in a second. Their clothes I'm keeping. My mom will dress them herself in her Instagram. So she will receive them like this in these outfits.
everything is gone, I can start drawing their new faces. I don't know, let's probably start with the snatched one. And I will try to keep their original vibes. One will be with very bright and glamorous smoky eye makeup. And another one will have a more natural look. So I want to give her really piercing green eyes and murky purple eyeshadows. I think it will look really pretty. Let's move on to the next doll and let's do the same there. Apply realistic shadows to her face, draw eyes, lips, eyebrows, yeah, create a new face.
I think I want to add some freckles to her face. It will add kind of some extra dimension to her look. I will not blush their bodies because these dolls will be changing their outfits all the time. And this paint from their bodies would peel off eventually, actually quite quickly. But I will spray on some freckles to the doll's body as well because it will kind of bring everything together. So now I'm going to apply glossy varnish to their eyes and lips, refresh their hair, put the clothes back and then we'll compare before and after pictures and we will decide if I manage to make these beautiful dolls look even better. Here they are guys, to be honest that was quite a strange challenge, repainting dolls that didn't really need to be repainted, so it was interesting even for myself if I could make them look better. And you know, I think I did. I think they still look like the same girls, the same characters, but they look much more realistic right now. And you know, I'm really happy and I'm even a little bit surprised about it. They look really good after my makeover. I don't know, what do you think, guys? Maybe, maybe you don't agree with me and it's okay. You have your right to disagree, but just let me know. Do you like these dolls before or after the makeover? And which one of them is your favorite? Let's talk about it in the comments please don't forget to follow me and my mom on our instagrams i'm going to ship these dolls to her the next week and then hopefully you will be able to observe these dolls in her instagram presenting new outfits made by my mom so and that was it that was my doll transformation of the week guys i really hope you've enjoyed it today and if so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel don't forget to support my art here on youtube with your likes and of course hit the bell button to get notified about my new doll repaint videos and the next repaints probably the next three dolls will be super special so don't forget to subscribe and i will see you there in the next video i don't know exactly yet maybe in one week maybe in two weeks i'm still actively working on all of them but anyway, I will see you very soon. Love you guys. Bye